So today I'll be talking about the things I wish I knew before I started nursing school. It is going to be a fun video because there are so many things I wish I knew before entering nursing school, before I started this journey. I just want to share that with you today and hopefully that will get you ready, that will prepare you for what is coming for you. So before we continue, if you're new to this YouTube channel, you are welcome. I hope you enjoy this channel. Please do subscribe and turn on your post notification button. The first thing I wish I knew before nursing school is it wasn't going to be as easy as I thought it was going to be. Like when they tell you it is hard, take it like that. Is that you take it or you leave it? Take it like that. Make sure you understand that yes, it's going to be hard. It's going to be tough. It gets tougher. I wish I trusted them more that it was going to be tough. It's going to be a hard pill to swallow. I wish I trusted them more. I wish I just took their words for it. And it's nothing like a prerequisite. Just know that if you have taken AMP, if you're taking microbiology, if you have taken all those courses, just know that it is nothing compared to the stress you go on. I thank God that I was able to scale through because you're not going to see the so many people scale through. The second thing I wish I knew before I started nursing school is that there is competition and there is no competition. I'm a very competitive person. I love competing for grades, for everything. And let me tell you, if you're such a person, if you're like me, take a chill pill, okay? Slow down. It is not a competition. Nursing school is something that will get you closer to people ASAP. Like ASAP. You have to go closer to people. You're not, you're not competing against them. You're competing against the struggles of nursing school. Competition can be healthy. But what I'm saying is that face your lane. If you want an A, face it and say i can get this a don't be like oh i can get better than what she's getting i'm someone that loves a's i don't like b's and i got my first couple of b's in nursing school so let me tell you something you're not competing against people you're competing against the struggles you want to become an rn right take people along with you take people on this journey it's not easy to go on this kind of journey alone okay so that's my advice the third thing I wish I knew before nursing school is that you won't have a lot of time to yourself anymore. Time is going to be your greatest enemy in nursing school. You're going to have to use time to study. You're going to have to use a lot of time to go for lectures. Well, you have to go for lectures. Don't think you can just skip through lectures. It's not going to work. Sorry to break it to you, but it's not going to work. I would employ that you go for your lectures. You're going to use a lot of time in class. You're going to use a lot of time in clinicals. Clinicals is like a second job. Clinicals is like a full-time job. Well, not exactly because you don't go every day of the week, but you do go two times a week, and that is a lot. A lot for a lot of people that work. I wish I knew that I'll be spending so much time studying, so much time going for lectures, so much time just in the material because... Studying takes a huge chunk out of nursing school. Like, you have to study non-stop. It is something you really, really, really do have to do. If you have been acing through your prerequisites during your previous semesters without reading, without opening the textbook, without reading your book, without taking notes, that is not going to work for nursing school. So I advise you to start preparing your mind ahead for the amount of time you're going to use to read. So let me give you one advice. Before you start nursing school, make sure you live your life to the fullest, okay? Don't let anybody tell you otherwise. Go for the, all those parties, go for all those movies that you wanna go and watch, go out. Just don't stay at home because you're going to be staying at home. No, let me, let me rephrase that. You're gonna be staying in the library throughout nursing school <laughs> congratulations okay so let me just tell you the truth you're going to be using so much out of your time to study to read to look at material upon material so let me tell you enjoy your life another thing i wish i knew before i started nursing school is that things get emotional real quick 
there are going to be clash of the titans here and there there are going to be people that you don't get along with that happens everywhere but guess what these are people that you inter you have to interact with in the nursing program like there's no way about it you guys are stuck in this together so like you guys go from one class to another together that's if someone doesn't make it which is sad that's one of the things that get things quickly awkward and emotional is when people drop out of the course you tend to see less of your classmates you tend to see less of your course mates in the program because they have dropped they withdrew or something happened that they couldn't continue with that program anymore so it gets kind of emotional towards the end so you are kind of drained towards the end like you're drained like my fifth exam or my fourth exam i was so drained that i could i just i just i was already on the holiday already my head was on holiday already like it has forgotten that i was still in school i don't know how it how it abandoned me like that but it did because i was tired i was drained i was stressed so that made me score way below my average way below what i would usually get if i studied as much i had to take care of me more i had to like spend time with me more you know to like reboot and i was just tired it was nursing school is a time where you talk with friends on a deep level you guys will talk you guys will become friends real quick that's it you guys will become friends real real quick Am I communicating? I hope you guys are understanding what I'm saying. So number four, I wish I understood more of the grading system before I started nursing school. If I just understood a little bit more, it would have helped me to not stress too much. The grading system is way different from when you were taking your prerequisites because a C is 76% in my program. Anything below a C is a fail. Like you get an F. There is no D, there is no E it is f <laughs> straight f there is no debating there is no arguing on that there is none of that because even if you get a 75.9 it is still an f like at the end of the course it's still an f and if you get to use you're out of the program asap that's psh, you're gone as in money gone everything gone time gone out the window Phew! Boop. any small mistake any small error anything that you do can actually jeopardize everything okay so be careful the grading system was messed up and their questions and everything is so different and man we have to think critically in nursing school to answer those questions because there is no just one right answer they choose choose the best right answer like who does that nursing school so another thing i wish i knew before i started nursing school is that there are no breaks now i know that they give you a holiday maybe they give you christmas holiday they give you winter break before you get the spring semester maybe they give you a summer i don't know anything they give you any holiday you have before your next semester don't consider it a break once you enter the nursing program just know that you're in it for the long haul you're in it to go straight to the end and then receive your break even during those breaks they still give you reading plans like i advise even if they don't give you ask your senior so that you can start reading ahead start reading ahead prepare ahead there is no break for you ever since i started my second semester we're going to be having quiz exam quiz exam back to back weekly 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 up until like march so it's going to be it's going to be a lot of work and yes i did try reading but girl cannot come and die like i can't kill myself in this no simple i have to leave i have to leave to go to work after the nursing program so guys i have come to the end of this youtube video i hope you did enjoy this youtube video if you did give it a thumbs up if you did not give it a thumbs up it's a yes or yes situation man i know you did enjoy this video don't lie don't lie don't lie give it a thumbs up and make sure you do hit that subscribe button make sure you turn on your post notification button too so that you can get instant notification whenever i release a new 
video you can also tell me if you want a video on nursing faith or life that you want me to talk about that you want me to share please tell me in the comments below i read everything i i i'm so grateful for my subscribers they're amazing like have the best fun ever <laughs> thank you so much for being a subscriber so i'll see you next time in my next youtube video have a great day enjoy your day enjoy your night wherever you are bye <laughs>